I'm Rosie Sexton. I'm a professional mixed martial arts fighter, fighting out of Next Generation MMA in Liverpool, and I'm fighting for Cage Warriors this Saturday. I've been involved in the sport since um, since 2000. Uh, my first fight was in 2002, and I've been fighting since then, so 12 years. Uh, I fought on the very first Cage Warriors event back in 2002, uh, and I've fought six times with the promotion since then. I've also fought all over the world, uh, for, it's like um, Bodog Fight, Bellator, Elite XC, uh, and uh, most recently UFC as well. And yeah, it's good to be coming back. It's, to, it's good to be coming back home. So I'm fighting Joanna Jedracek. I think that's how you pronounce her surname. It's Polish, and I'm not absolutely sure. That's my best guess so far. She's um, she's a good striker. She's young up and comer. She's a really good European prospect. Five and zero at the moment, coming off two wins against seasoned veterans. Um, so I'm expecting a really good tough fight. The fight was only confirmed quite recently, as a, a few weeks ago. I've known for a while that Ian Dean's been looking for a matchup for me on Cage Warriors. I'm always in the gym anyway, I'm always training. You know, I was in good shape before that. It's been a short fight camp, but at the same time, I think sometimes that can work well for me because I'm, I'm just peaking at the right time. I think in the past, sometimes when I've had a lot of notice for a fight, I've maybe done a little bit too much, been a little bit overtrained, uh, which has sort of not had quite so much energy going into it. So again, it can, it can work both ways with that. Uh, I, I mean, I know Joanna fought recently as well, uh, not, not so long ago, so I'm expecting her to be in good shape. Historically, I've had some problems with strikers in the past. And I think um, three out of three, three of my losses have been against um, strikers with a similar background. So I think that's one of the things that makes this an interesting matchup. This is this is why it's a, why it's a good fight for me and why it's a good fight to watch um, because it, it answers those questions. And I think um, there's no point taking a fight if it if it doesn't answer the hard questions. And I'm looking forward to having the opportunity to show that on Saturday. The old guard versus the young up and coming prospect kind of fight, um, which everyone likes. <laughs>